so how it feels like having this CPU G3240 well that's a question we gonna answer so basically it has 3.1 gigahertz 3 megabyte of cache smart one and two cores two threads as you can see it's not multitasking right now it works fine with Camtasia Camtasia 2019 still haven't tried the newer ones but anyways it can support 32 gigs and DDR3 RAM which with this speed 1333 and I can say that this this is the, the limit if you have like 1060 it can't run that and yeah how about gaming you say gaming gaming I'm gonna show you some games and you tell me what you think so it can run some pixelated games bad graphics game actually I don't have graphics maybe if you get the graphics it will help anyways but it still will give stress on your CPU if you open the task manager and go here as you can see it's already taking 50% from OBS studio yeah that's how it feels to have Intel Pentium G3 1240 and the memory I got 8 doesn't matter the GPU that's the integrated GPU by the way yeah so definitely get a GPU to help yourself so recently I've been playing Legend of Heroes Tales of Cold Steel series and yeah it works fine on uh, those games but yeah in the next i7 i will see what it, it can run oh by the way my favorite game metal gear metal gear rising revengeance yeah metal gear rising revenge it works perfectly on that game so yeah i guess i'm not sure if it works on that high resolution and by the way this, this is the optimal resolution for this CPU if I get any higher it starts lagging this CPU and this resolution this res not even this recommended this so yeah that's uh, for the smooth this experience you want to get from if you have a Pentium like me should set it to around that and yeah for video editing i use camtasia i tried adobe premiere and it lags so much even even after i added my uh, gpu there is stress on the cpu so you can't can technically do video editing with this but i'm trying my best right now that's it i guess that's pretty much everything you need to know about this cpu and yeah for more details just ask me in the comment section goodbye mm -hmm.